Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Nate Triple O G. And yes, I have another review for you guys today. Yo, this is about to be bananas. You know, I have some mixed feelings about this review. And yo, it's just like, like, why? Like, why, why, why? You know, I'm gonna put up some, I'm gonna put some numbers up. We're gonna talk numbers, we're gonna talk resale. But what we're gonna really talk about, and I know everybody like, y'all on yay ass, right? Yay can't breathe, y'all on his ass. Ass motherfucking hole, y'all own that. Y'all own that. But yay got the Midas touch. Yay has the Midas touch. Long story short, Let's go ahead and get into this like right about now. But before we do anything else, before we carry on, I need you guys to like this video, hit that subscribe button, and ring the hell out of that notification bell so you can stay in tune with all the fire that I'm bringing you. Let's go. So we got that orange Nike box. Ladies and gentlemen, I got that Nike M2K Techno. That's what we got. Let's get up close and personal with the shoe. And I'm gonna tell you why Yeezy still got the Midas touch. Let's go. So we got that plain Jane Nike box. Well, let's go ahead and get into it. Nothing, nothing special should be happening with this box. This is the Nike, the women's Nike's M2K Techno. There you go for all my box lovers. Retail, retail for 100 dollars one hundo retail let's get into this shoe though let's open that joint up boom got that paper whatever bong yeah uh-huh yeah other shoe other shoe yeah man look, come on let's, let's get this here right? let's get this here. so there you have it ladies and gentlemen the women's m2k techno pretty much the monarch 2.0 pretty much if yeezy made the 700 and it was over there with nike this is probably this is a variation of what we would have you know what i mean and and the whole thing is yo let me go ahead and show y'all the shoe while i'm talking the whole thing about the shoe is it's not that bad that's the whole thing. But then I wonder, am I only saying that because Jay put up a tweet? I'm going to put that tweet like right here saying that Yeezy 700 vibes. Is that why I'm saying the shoe not bad? Do y'all want me to like to really go in depth with the review? Forget it, I will. Yo, so we got that powder blue two-tone Mustang thing right here in the toe box with this X. A lot of things going on. Nice stitching right here. Not bad. We can look at that. Nike check on the toe right there. So we got this, you know, it's the basic like Monarch, like 2.0. Like all I see, I got to put some pictures right here. Dash shoes, Monarchs. Ridiculous, right? Ridiculous. But this here though, got that black. Now this is a slimmer shoe. You know, obviously it's a slimmer shoe because it's a women's shoe. And I think that's the reason why I say it doesn't look so bad. It's not so wide. We got this orange that, that really pops on the heel. You know what I mean? Insole. Nike on the insole. Got that Nike on the tongue also. Check right there. Whole bunch of patterns right here, real soft. Hold on one second. Let, let, let's, let's compare. Let's let let's really compare these things to the 700s. Are they the same? Let's see. All right. So we don't have a lot of space. So I'm gonna do forget. I'll do the left shoe of this one, and I'll do the right shoe of this one. Let's do that now. So if you look at it, right? <clears throat> so if you look at it, Yeezy got the patches right here on both sides. Boom, boom. Toe box looks like an X kind of right. Right here looks like an X. <laughs> Boom, boom, toe box, right? Got that joint right here. Looks similar to that X right here, right? You know what I mean? Here, with the Nike on there. Here, we got that 3M Reflect, right? Um, obviously, green shoe strings, white shoe strings, whatever. Let's go ahead, let's go to the size of the shoe, 
Alright, I'll take that, put that away. Nice blotches right there. Same thing here. Boom, boom, boom. I mean, if we had to look at both dad's shoes, they got he got oranges on his, but his is 3M. They got that. This is like a plastic, but it really does pop. It really does. And I wonder what it looks like if light hits it. Anyway, look at the soles. Uh, I guess no comparison with that. Obviously got the best technology in the world. Boost. You know what I mean? And Nike definitely doesn't have that. But I mean, like, the shoes are so fucking similar. You know, Kanye started a wave this crazy. And this is Kanye before slavery was a choice. Know that. Anyway, what, what are you guys thinking, man? Like, what are you, what are you really thinking? You know what I mean? Please leave them comments below. Please. Bro, because I... You know, when you're just trying to be objective, in today's time, the shoe is not bad, but this is like that old, you know, old rich lady in the mall shopping, and she want to put on her nice gym shoes and go for a stroll, and she went inside Chanel and bought a couple bags, and she got a bag. It, it, hey, that's, that's what I'm saying with this shoe. That's what this look like. Some old rich person. <laughs> what am I saying? Get the fuck out of here. This shoe here, Y'all, I'm really speechless, but let's go back face to face. So before we move on, I do want to talk numbers. So let's, let me, let me uh, look. I see guys can see that I was searching some Supreme, but let, let's talk, let's talk numbers for a second. Uh, what is this? M Rock to K, there we go. <sighs> look at this, man. Last sale was $345. You know, the stock was up 145% and obviously that was a, I don't, I don't know what size that was, but we're going to review all sales. Yeah, that was for a size 10.5, which is a nine men's. So that's some dude wanted this shoe and he wouldn't pay that bag. But look at this, nine, 201, 300, 151, 171, 241, 255, 261, 360. Come on, bro, 275. So, and then this was not the only colorway to release, though. That's the whole thing. This was not the only colorway to release. So, I don't know. Is it all hype, yo? Like, it's, look at this. They got this black one right here. You know, this is the black one. Yeah, this is the black one. The black one, uh, you know, I was looking at sales on this one, but this was popping too. If we scroll down, 180, 205. You know what I mean? 191. You know what I mean? Not bad. But then they got a pink one also. You know, I just, you know, oh, fuck it. While I'm doing this, I might as well, right? So they got this pink one. And even the pink one. Look at these sales. 210. Now, this, these got to be men buying these shoes. Look at, look at, look. This is, as I scroll down, you know, oh my. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five. The five at the bottom. 500, 500, 500, 500. Come on. You pay five hundred dollars for this, and I don't know if I should be mad at night. Is it all hype? Is being a hype beast hurting us like this? You know, you know, I cried tears for somebody last night who spent five hundred dollars on this shoe and I wasn't crying because I was sad that they spent their $500 I was crying because I'm pissed that I wasn't the one to sell it to them bro come on bro we gotta do better I gotta do better you know what I'm saying I'm buying everything and anything from now on fuck that you know that that's that, that that's that's what it is that, that's, that's what I gotta do I'm buying I'm buying everything bro and I'm not gonna stop. I'm buying first, ask questions last. You know what I'm saying? And I suggest you do the same thing too. My followers, be smart, buy everything. If you can't sell it, take it back to the store. But don't you ever miss out on an opportunity like this. But tell me what you guys think. You know, am I tripping? Is this, is this fire? Because you know, 
that's what we have. Everybody got an opinion. This this just might be fire. And maybe I just haven't caught up to the wave yet. Pun intended, bro. Because I see Nike did. You know what I mean? Like, comment, subscribe. Please leave me that feedback. I'll let you guys next time. Peace. No time soon.